All right, yesterday we did a little science experiment with the density of water and salt water, right? And what did we find happens with salt water? That um, we tried regular water and salt water, see what would float with two eggs. And then the egg in the real water sank, and the one in the salt water floated. Yeah, that's because the density of the salt water helps things float. Yeah, it does. So there's a sea. What's that sea called? The Dead Sea. The Dead Sea. And P and um And what did we learn about the Dead Sea? Yeah. Are yeah. draining it out. Yeah. To get the salt and sell it just for money. And how do they get the salt out of the water? They pump it out, and they um, put it in tanks, and they take the salt out and just let the water dissolve. Yeah, they, they let the care. water evaporate, and what's left over is the salt, right? Yes. Yeah. They don't even care about the water. No, they don't. And what's happening to the community and the town around it? You remember what you saw in the video? What was happening to the roads and stuff? Were they sinking? They were getting yeah. destroyed. Destroyed. Yeah. Full on, literally destroyed. Yeah. That's Highway 19, humongous pothole. Mm -hmm. Yeah. How does that make you feel? Very mad. Very mad. Yeah. If you were in charge over there, what is something you would do to stop that? I would make a rule as money isn't everything mm -hmm. and that you're not allowed to drain out a lake that yeah. belongs to two other towns. Mm -hmm. It doesn't just belong to two other towns. Who does it really belong to? God. That's right. No. But he Do you did think... make the sea for the people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the people that are draining it out don't care yeah that god made it for the other people yeah are there other lakes and rivers that are drying up yeah do you remember what the one name of the lake is uh no lake me lake mead Lake Mead, the people needed that water to water their plants and mm. their bodies. Mm -hmm. They're not wasting it to get money. Yeah, and what's happening with the weather over there that's making it hard? Is it's it super hot. Yeah, it's super hot. So there's lots of places in the States that are really dry right now, right? Yeah, it's a big problem, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what are some ways that we can save our our water? What are ways we can conserve our water usage? Not do three pairs of laundry a day. <laughs> not do, not take three hours of showers. Yeah. Three hour showers, you'd come out like a prune. <laughs> 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 You'd be a Sammy prune. <laughs> Full 12 hours you would be like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you what would be wrinklier than a raisin. Yeah. What else? A lot of people water lawns. What do you think? Bad way to waste water. Bad way to waste water, yeah. Who, like, who needs to water their lawns? You can just use rain. Wait yeah. for rain. And, yeah, exactly. You could just wait for rain, hey? You don't yeah. need to water your lawns every day. Yeah. You don't just go to a lake, get, like, three tots of water to water your lawn. Yeah, that'd be crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Alrighty. Even if your lawn is super dead. Yeah. Just wait for rain to grow back. Mm-hmm.
So those are all really good ways that we can save water, right? Yeah. We get like 500 total water. Mm -hmm. What two gases make up water? Ooh, we just learned that. Um, he, no, not helium. No, not helium. Close. Uh, you need oxygen. Yeah, water. you need oxygen. Um, you are right with it, starting with an H. Uh, Hi. Hydrogen? Yes. So you need hydrogen. And, and oxygen. And so you then put what? them together and they make water. They do. So that is called H... H2O. H2O. High five, man. Good, good lesson today. <laughs> another high five. All right, another one. Ah! <laughs> good lesson? Another high five. Here, dork. I high love five. you. High five. High five. High five. <laughs>